Okay, hi, good morning, or good afternoon, or good evening to everyone out there. My name is Kendi. I'm the teacher here on verblink.com. This class is going to be for intermediate or advanced speakers who want to get practice speaking. It will be a speaking class, so you don't need a pen or a pencil or a piece of paper. Uh, we will be going through questions to help you practice with conditionals. So to enter the class, um, right now if you have a reservation or if you are a Verbling Premium member, now's the time to get in. It will be um, just for you guys for the first few moments. And then after, after a few minutes, I think um, more people will be able to join. So now's the time to get in if you have a reservation. Um, and when, when you see the green Join Class button up in the upper right-hand corner, go ahead and click that and you will be in class. Once you're in the class, you can close Verbling.com and make sure you have your headphones because we don't want an echo. Um, all right, and I think we have someone that just joined us. S direct. How are you? Are you with us? Um, okay. I can't hear you if you're there. So sometimes when you join the class, your microphone is automatically muted. So it's important to unmute your microphone when you get into the class. Okay, they just went away. Um, all right. If you are not a premium member, um, that's fine. You can still get uh, reservations by doing a couple different things. On verbling.com, up in the upper right hand corner, um, there's a link for get reservations. And you can do a few things like refer some friends or watch a video. And you can use this to gain yourself some free reservations and test them out to see if you like them. So you can do that. Um, all right, so conditionals, this will be a conversation class. I hope to have you guys speaking as much as possible. Um, I think we're still waiting for more people to join in. So, of course, I will wait for you to get into the class uh, before we continue. Um, Al, uh, hey, how are you? Hi, Candy. Alex, okay. Hi. Yes. Alex, how are you? How are you? I'm good. I'm fine. Good. <laughs> I feel like I haven't taught. I haven't taught in like two or three days, so it feels like a really long time. <laughs> oh, How yeah. have you been, Alex? How have you been? Oh. What's new? Uh. I don't know. <laughs> have you been okay? Uh, yes, I am. Okay, wonderful. Good. Thank you. Thanks for being here. So, Alvo, how are you? I'm fine. And you? Wonderful. Thank you. Salvo, do you have headphones? Yes. Okay. Because there's an echo. And also, please close verbling.com. Oh, your microphone is on mute. Check your microphone. I think it's still on mute. Anyway, thank you for being here. I'll come back to you. Nemo, how are you today? I'm fine. How about you? Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you. Um, <laughs> all right. <laughs> and Arturo, how are you? Arturo, are you there? I can see you. I don't know if you can hear us, but uh, I don't know. I don't see you talking. Akram, how are you? Akram? Uh, okay, your microphone might also be on mute. So sometimes that happens when you enter into the class and you go to the Google Hangout, your microphone is automatically on mute. Unmute it. So it's right above the Verbling chat. Okay. Salvo, do we get your sound working? No, still can't hear you. <laughs> Can you? Okay. Yeah, Arturo. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm so okay, tired right what? now. You're so tired. Yes. 
Where are you from? I'm from Peru. Peru, cool. Okay, cool. Welcome. Thank you for being here. Akram, can you hear us? I can't hear you, Akram. I'm sorry. Yes, I can. I can't hear you. Yes. Oh, Arturo. Okay, good. All right, good. Thank you. Um, Nemo, can you tell everyone in the class where you are from? I'm from Egypt. Okay, good. Thank you. Welcome back. And Salvo, can you tell everyone where you're from? Salvo, we can't hear you. Check your microphone. I'll come back to you. Oh. Are you there? Salvo? I think a lot of us are having sound issues today. Uh, yeah, we still can't hear you, Salvo. I'm sorry. Make sure your microphone is not red. It's not on mute. I don't know. There's a setting above the Verbling chat box. And Alex, can you tell everyone what country you're from? Oh, yes. I'm from Russia. Okay, cool. All right, welcome. So today we're going to be getting practice with using the conditionals. And I will be asking you a series of questions. And also, you guys will be asking each other questions, OK? Um, so let's start. I guess, Alex, I will start with you. The first question is, uh, if you were, oh, who said hi? Who was that? <laughs> Nemo? No, no, not me. It was oh, okay. uh, Atro, I think. Arturo, okay, good. Yes, we can hear you, Arturo. That's wonderful. Salvo, did you unmute what your microphone? What was that, Arturo? What I I don't know what you said. I think your connection is very slow. I don't know what you said. Akram, are you there? Mm, okay, Akram, we can't hear you. So everyone, I guess I will type it in. This will be the last time. Check your microphone settings above the burbling chat. It's red. It's muted. Okay. All right. I hope everyone gets it to work. So, Alex, I'm going to start with you. Here's a question. If okay. you were an animal, which animal would you be? And I want you to answer in complete sentences. So, if you were an animal, which animal would you be? If I want to see animal. If you were an animal. Were? What is it? If you were an animal. Uh, you are a human. You are a human being. Oh, but I understand. If you, if you were an animal, which okay, animal okay. would you be? So, you know, uh, if I were an animal, uh, mm -hmm. I want to be a cat, I think. You because, would be. Uh, you would cat. want to be a cat. Yeah, so you want to say, I would want to be a cat, or I would be a cat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I would be a cat, so... Uh, because uh, it's uh, this animal is uh, um, this animal have freedom, I think. Oh, I don't know how I can say it. Okay, they have freedom. They maybe they are independent. Oh, maybe yes. <laughs> is that what you mean? Okay, <laughs> and then. Um, um, from the class, I also want to encourage follow-up questions, right? So maybe, what would you do? Let's say you're an ant. Let's say you're a cat. What would you do now? As a cat, what would you do? Where would you go? How would you spend your days? No. Oh. Uh, maybe uh, I'll just go to walk on the street uh. and uh, uh, and play with other cats. For <laughs> okay, all right. Nemo, did you want to say something? 
No, no. no. <laughs> okay, I thought I saw you pop up. Okay, good. Good, thank you. Akram, are you there? Can you hear us? Uh, Salvo? <laughs> you hear me? Hear me? Yes, Salvo, we can hear you. Where are you from? Italy. You're from Italy. Cool. Okay, cool. Thanks for being here. And then Akram, can you hear us? Indeed. Are you with I us? I hear you. Yes, yes, yes. Awesome. awesome. Yes, now we can hear you. Where are you from? From Egypt. You're from Egypt? Yes. Cool. Okay, good. Alex, I want you to ask the same question to Nemo, please. Oh, I have to ask him some questions. The same question that I asked you. Oh, <clears throat> okay. Nemo, uh, mm, oh. If you want, no. <laughs> mm. It's difficult. <laughs> if you were, what? If you were an animal, which would oh, you? If you were an animal, uh, which uh, which kind of animal would you be? <laughs> What do you be in? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, if, I were, if I were, if I were an animal, I uh -huh. would, uh, I would be uh, a dolphin. Oh, okay. So, question, yeah. follow-up question: Why would you be a dolphin? Uh, they are uh, uh, cooperate. They cooperate with each other when they have a shark attack, and uh, uh, the sharks can't defeat them or eat them. And they are they are also uh, funny and uh, helpful, and uh, I like the way they look. You know, I really like those you things. Like, you like the way they look? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they're really cute. Good. Yeah, they are cute. Good. <laughs> what would you do? What would you do all day if you were a dolphin? What would you do? I will swim and having fun. I will. Uh, <laughs> You know they are uh, playing with each other all the time. They are um, more, more <laughs> um, and they are they are making something like like show in the in the water, <laughs> yeah, like they're <laughs> like... and jumping and something like that. Yeah, and they are always, always in, the, in, in the in in group. Mhm. Mm yeah, they are always yeah. in group. So you want to say? You would. You would swim all day. You would play with the other dolphins. You would, right? Because this is kind of imaginary. So, yeah, yeah. Um, if, right? I will. I will play all day is definite. You will. But you will not be a dolphin. So you would <laughs> do these things if you were. Good. Okay. Thank you. Can okay. you ask Salvo the same question? Okay. Well, Salvo, yes. if you were an animal, which animal would you be? Um, uh, I want to be a tiger. <laughs> you a tiger. would be a tiger. Yes. Okay. And, so. And why did you choose uh, to be a tiger? <laughs> because it's because the tiger is uh, very strong. Is uh, very free. <laughs> Okay, good. What would you do as a tiger? What would you do all day? Uh, to stay in the forest alone. <laughs> you would stay in the forest alone? Yes. <laughs> okay, all right, cool. Okay, so my next question, I will start, Salvo, I want to start with you. If you could meet any person, alive or dead, who would you meet? So if you could meet someone that is alive now, or if you could meet someone that has already died, who would you meet? 
if we, uh, if uh, I was uh, a tiger, I want uh, to meet uh, a bear. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's really that's very I'll creative. Uh, to talk uh, about uh, the other uh, the other uh, animals in the forest. <laughs> okay. What about you are Salvo now? You are Salvo. And yes. being Salvo, who would you want to meet? I want to meet um, Obama. I want to be Obama. I want to be the government oh, okay. of Italy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But you, not be, but who would you want to meet and say, Hi, I'm Salvo. Nice to meet you. Um, and you can eat dinner or have lunch with someone. Who would it be? You would want to meet Obama and have dinner with Obama? Yes. Yes. I want okay. to talk uh, with Obama. <laughs> <laughs> what would you ask him? Uh, what do you like to discuss uh, about the problem uh, of the world? <laughs> <laughs> All day. <laughs> yeah, I think you would be talking for a long time. Um, okay, so we want to use words. I don't know. Can you guys see the chat? I can't seem to see the chat box, but we want to use words like uh, would and would and could, right? So you would want to meet him, and you would want to talk about the problems of the world, right? Yes. Okay. Um, what would be what would be the first question that you ask him? Uh, I was an animal. No, 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 no. You are Salvo, and you meet Obama, and you have dinner with him, and it's just you and Barack at the table eating dinner. What would you ask him? What would your first question be? Uh. Um, world or cold? Uh, I don't understand. <laughs> okay, no problem. So. Okay, so let's say you are eating dinner with uh, Barack yes. Obama in a restaurant. Yeah. Ah, a restaurant with Obama. You, you uh, and Obama. Yeah. I, I ask. Uh, I ask him uh, who paid uh, the dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I think Obama will would pay the dinner. Uh, who paid the dinner? If I uh, want to uh, pay me or I pay you? Uh, if I pay you, if I pay me, uh, I ask him to uh, to dinner a little. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think me. Other Americans are paying for your dinner. <laughs> but okay. All right. Good. Thank you. Salvo, can you ask Nemo the same question? Yes. Uh, if uh, the animal, the question of uh, animal, about animal. No. no? If, if, could, if you could meet uh, anyone. Ah, uh, Nemo. Uh, uh, who, who would do you like uh, meet uh, uh, in the future? <laughs> okay, good. Thank you, Nemo. Go ahead. Okay, I would like. I would. Uh, if I could, uh, if I could meet any person, I would like to meet uh, uh, Miriam Ferris and have dinner with her. She's a celebrity here. She's an European uh, a a singer, and I really ah. like her a lot. <laughs> <Yeah>. Okay. <laughs> Teacher, <laughs> I go to I go to Hawaii. I can uh, I I can't stop. You, what? You are leaving class? Yes, because uh, I have to to do a uh, uh, something. I have to uh, I have to. Be uh, give a a milk to my daughter. <laughs> okay, no problem. Okay, thank you for joining us, bye, Salvo.
Thank you, thank you so, so much for uh, the class, for the lesson. Thank you. Ten minutes. Bye. Thank you. So have a good night. Bye. Bye-bye. Um, bye, Hall. Okay, so Nemo, can you type yeah. in uh, the, her name in the chat box? Maria Ferris. And I can, I can get you a link of her pictures. <laughs> okay. Yeah, can you type in her name, please? Okay. Mary and Paris. Okay, and she's a singer. So where? Okay, where would you? First of all, I want to welcome Levy to the class, and we'll go back to you, Nemo. Levy, welcome. Okay. How are you? Hi. How are you? Great. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm from the United States. I just thought it might be interesting to see it from the other side. I've been taking Spanish classes, and I just <laughs> wanted to see it. You kind of know. I mean, it's stupid, but you know. <laughs> No, that's that's fine. That's fine. We are doing um, conditional uh, questions, so you are more than welcome to participate. We okay, have great. like three people in this class, including you, so you can totally participate if you want. No problem. Awesome. Sounds um, fun. All right. Uh, okay. So Nemo, where um, I want to know now, where where would you? What would you want to do with her? Where would you, on a date, where would you take her? Okay. Uh, I would take her Let's to... Let's say you, uh, money is no object. You could take her anywhere. Where would you take okay. her? I would take her to, uh, to have dinner at the uh, Hilton uh, Hotel. And okay. <laughs> and after that, I will try to take her home with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, so you're at dinner now. You're just at dinner. Um, what would okay. you ask her? Hmm. I would ask, ask her. I I won't. Uh, uh, I'm not gonna. Uh, I wouldn't be talking about anything about her. Uh, 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 that she, she's a singer or something like that. I would talk to her in in person. I will ask her. About her personal life, I okay, would like, like to know more about her. Mm, okay. Uh, what would you like to know about her? What would your first question to her be? Mm, I would uh, I would ask her uh, uh, what uh, what does she do in her life? What does she she what uh, what's her her routine? About 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 her her life. What 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 she what does she do every day? Okay, and what you want to say maybe what does she think about her life? What does she think about her yeah. life? Hmm. Okay. All right. Good. Thank you, Nemo. Can you ask Levi the same question? Okay. Is it Levi or Levi? Levi. Now that I know where you're from, okay. No <laughs> right. problem. Levi. Yeah, most um most of my Spanish speaking friends call me Levy, so I respond to both. So. Okay. okay, all right. And where are you from in the States? Originally, um upstate New York, but I live in Mississippi now. Oh wow, that's like a whole different country for me. Yeah. I'm from California. <laughs> oh yeah, it's very different here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, good. So um, Nemo, can you ask uh, Levi the same question? Okay. So, Levi, if you could meet anyone, who would you like to meet? Who, who would you meet? Alive or dead? Alive or dead. This is very yeah. difficult. I'm... <laughs> Let me see. This is such a difficult question. Um, Let's say... Just for the purpose of saying something, um, let's say. Mm. Like if you could have dinner with someone, or if you could see, have lunch with someone. See this? <laughs> you you would look guilty. <laughs> let's see. Um, let's just say um, Gordon Ramsay, because I would have him cook it, and I'm sure it would be an awesome dinner or lunch. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, do you got Nemo and Alex, do you know who Gordon Ramsay is? No. Really no, don't. I don't. No. Can you tell them who Gordon Ramsay is? 
Um, Gordon Ramsay is a famous British chef. Yeah. British chef? What is it? Like, uh, do you know what a chef is? Like, um, someone who um, cooks professionally. Oh. Okay, and he's um, British, so he's from um, Britain. Yeah, so he would yeah. want to meet him and have Gordon Ramsay cook for him cook also. For him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alex, what what can you ask Lev what can you ask I'm sorry, what can you ask Levi? Like a follow up question. He would want to meet Gordon Ramsay and he would want to have Gordon Ramsay cook for him. And what else? What else can you ask him about his meeting with him? Uh, question for Larry. Yeah, ask Le ask Levi a question. Oh, well, for example, if you leave uh, this person, uh, what what first question uh, would you like uh, to ask him? I think maybe a question I would ask Gordon Ramsay is, um, when did he decide he wanted to be a chef? for his career? Like at what age? That's a good mm -hmm. question. Mm -hmm. What okay. what would you want him to cook for you? I think I would ask him to cook his signature dish, um, whatever um, whatever he feels the best uh, about cooking because I'm sure um, his favorite thing to prepare is what he cooks the best. All right. Okay. Yeah, that's good. I don't even know what his signature dish would be. Does he have one? I don't know. I'm um. I eat all kinds of food though, so I would tell him surprise me with your favorite thing to cook because I'm sure it will be great. Oh, that's a good answer. Okay. Um, I want to thank you, Le Levi. I want to welcome Arthur. Welcome back to class. How are you? Hello. Hello. Uh, hi, everyone. I'm fine. Thank you, Candy. How are you? I'm great, thank you. Nice to see you again. Um, can you tell everyone in the class where you're from? Uh, I'm from Armenia, but currently I live in the United States, in Los Angeles. In Los Angeles? Yeah, <laughs> in Los <Yeah>. Angeles. Right? <laughs> Another Californian right. in the chat. Yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. Um, very, very, very missed uh, Los Angeles, yeah. I do. I do, especially on rainy days like this. Ugh. Oh. But uh, What's you the will weather come like? here back in summer? Yeah, for a little bit, for a short time, maybe one month. I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, what is the weather like over there hmm. right now? Weather right now, you know, now it's 12.30 uh, a.m., but for now it's about maybe 20, 22. Uh, I'm oh. saying by Celsius okay. it's gonna be I, I don't know maybe 60, 65. Oh, I oh, can just say you, nice. I can say you just exactly how the weather now and now is 63 Fahrenheit. All right, that's not bad. That's better mm -hmm. than here. Okay, good, cool. Well, thanks for being here. We are asking each other um, hypothetical situation, hypothetical questions. Uh, mm -hmm. Levi, can you ask Arthur the same question? Okay, Arthur, if you could sit down and have a meal with any person, alive or dead, uh, who would you choose? Mm, or who I will choose to have a meal and sit and have a meal with him? Yes. Yeah, or her. Mm. Him or yeah. her. Who would you? Yeah, I I uh, I would rather to have a meal with some girls or some girl, not her, not with him, and mm, maybe girlfriend or just best friend. I would you would choose to. your boy. You would choose your best friend. Yeah, best friend or girlfriend. Uh, you know, I just <laughs> like to discuss some things um, during eating. That is so sweet. You would you if you could meet anyone in the world in history, you would still oh. choose your best friend. 
That's really sweet. Uh, oh, yeah, I, I yeah. just don't understand the question. <laughs> oh, I no, can choose. No, it's okay. Yeah. I can choose anyone in the world. Anyone in the world, even if they are dead now, they will rise from the dead and have dinner with you. Oh. Well, I need to think about <laughs> I have very favorites, <laughs> you know. Mm. It's a difficult question. Yeah, yeah. Maybe <laughs> I would like to have, have a meal with uh, Beyonce or maybe with Rihanna. <laughs> uh, maybe with Why? Uh, Kim it's so weird. <laughs> okay, all together. Okay. All together, um, yeah. <laughs> well, that's just a strange choice. I have no idea why you would choose those women. <laughs> I just love them, you know. They are my favorite. I'm a fan of the Beyonce and just uh, I like the Kim Kardashian body and I like the Rihanna songs, you know. <laughs> would you... Would you want to meet Kim Kardashian now, pregnant Kim Kardashian, or before Kanye West, Kim Kardashian? No, oh, before Kanye West, sure. Yeah, me too. Uh -huh. oh, you don't, don't want, <laughs> or after, after, um, after pregnancy, Kim Kardashian, and she could yeah. bring her baby with her. Yeah, no, not yeah. now. <laughs> All right. Okay, mommy Kim Kardashian. Okay, good. I just uh, want to answer one. I ask question, but this doesn't connect with the, this topic. Just I want to know that word, and I Google it, and I can't find. Uh, do you know how to say that thing uh, when the guys want to make their hairs back? And you know they putting in the head something like is similar. It's very look like a pantyhouse. house. Like something in the head, and when <laughs> yeah. you know what I mean? Is that called a do yeah, yeah. Is that what you call that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like what is? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You you tie this thing really tight on your head like this. Yeah. And uh, sleep with, yeah. sleep with it. A do rag? Is that what that would be? I think it's a do rag. I think what. What um? Where would you wear this? Just uh, you know, guys who wants to just have the you know the back hairstyle, they are putting in the head, and you can see that people in the street. And even if you uh, watching that, you will be very careful to you know to see that thing in the head. It's yeah, the do Yeah, it's direct. <laughs> direct. How how you spell it? That's a good question. That's a good question. <laughs> yeah. I'll, 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 let me Google that for you guys, okay? <laughs> I think I just... I've seen it on. I've seen it uh, in the stores, not here. It's either with a U or a D. Oh, no, this is so stupid. I can't believe I'm trying to do this do right like... now. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, I will search it. Just uh, I want to search it in the eBay, and <laughs> I just searched. Yeah. No. Handy on eBay, <laughs> you are you are in LA. Go to a store and get one. They have them there. They have them everywhere. Uh, which I know. I have today seen I was, them all uh, over the place. Today I was in a Macy's. I was in a Ross. I was in a Marshall. I was in a. No. Mm, no. They're not in Macy's. You have to go <laughs> to like. You have to go to like um, I've seen them in um, like big stores like Target, or yeah. I've seen them in gas station convenience stores, or mm. like drug stores like Rite Aid or um, yeah. CVS pharmacy. Yeah. Okay. So you have to go there. But nowadays, but you know, or I don't yeah, know. I'm going then. Yeah. I don't want to look funny, you know, just ask, you have a pantyhouse for hair, so <laughs> <laughs> ask, do rag. Do rag, yeah, okay. do, do rag. I really, I swear I have seen them in gas station convenience stores in really? multiple colors. So just go yeah, to like a mobile or an AMPM and just go look in the, in the stores. But, uh, you know, it's not Durag. I think you understand me wrong. Uh, the Durag is something but clothes, yeah? Mm, 
it's still and, this uh, thing that you put on your head, but yeah. it also like um, has extra fabric or material back here. It could also just be nylons that they take and tie around their yeah. head. It could just be uh -huh. you buy nylons and you just do it yourself. Mm. Okay, just I I searched at Durag and I can find <laughs> I just find uh, something in the clothes, but nothing uh, like that nylon. Yeah. Um. Oh, Arthur, are we friends on Facebook? Uh. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I th I think yeah. Just uh, I have a I have a Facebook page uh, that yeah. you can find it on verbling dot com. And okay. hi, Andre. I'm gonna get to you in one second. And if you f connect with me on Facebook, I will uh -huh. keep this in mind and I will try to send you. Uh, oh, okay, okay, some, yeah, true. Uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, I I will add you in my Facebook. <laughs> All right. Cool. Cool. Okay, Arthur, thanks for the question. That made my day. Um, I want to <laughs> welcome Andrea. How are you, Andrea? You're upside down. And your microphone is on mute. So check your microphone because I can't hear you. Hmm. I don't know where this noise. Arthur, is that noise coming from you? I'm gonna mute you. Okay, Andrea, are you there? You heard me? Yes. Uh, Andrea, are you talking to us? All right, I'll come back to you. Yeah, I can't. Can Can you guys hear him? I hear. I heard. Yeah, I hear somebody saying. Okay. Do you hear me? Yes. I okay. hear you. Okay. Oh, Can you hear him? There's, some, there's noise going on in the background. I'm getting confused. I think yeah. someone has a television on or something. Um, okay. Andrea, go ahead. Where are you from? And now you're on mute. Maybe. <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I, check. Okay. Do you hear me now? Yes. Yes. Thank okay. you. Sorry. Go ahead. Okay, I, I come from uh, Verona. Uh, Verona is in Italy. You probably know about uh, uh, the poem of Juliet and Romeo. Uh huh. <laughs> yes. Okay. And welcome. Thank you. <laughs> and um, um, how are you, you guys? Everything is okay today. We are fine. I don't understand how your camera is, how your video is upside down, but oh, me too. It's interesting. <laughs> Me too, because it's a, it's a laptop, but I think that there is a problem with the driver. Uh, oh, okay. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, well, thank you for being here. Um, Arthur, oh, yes, I can see what you're doing. Um, Andrea, I'm going to go ahead and ask you, we are practicing questions um, with hypothetical situations. So uh -huh. I will go ahead and ask you. Actually, first, I will welcome so, 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 so to the class. <laughs> welcome. So, 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 are you there? So, so, so. <laughs> so, so, please, what is, your, what is your name? What do you want me to call you? Yeah, my name is Selva. What is your name? Selva. My name is Selva. <coughs> Selva? Yeah, Selva. Cool. Cool name. Where are you from? Uh, from Saudi, US, Saudi Arabia, you know? Oh, Saudi, okay. Cool, yeah, oh. welcome, thanks for being here. Okay, um, thank you. Okay, so let's start, I'm going to start with Andrea. I'm going to ask you a new question. Andrea, um, yep. if you could be any famous person, if you could be any famous person for one week, who would you be? Akram, I'm going to mute you. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. oh, so um, I, I like to be. I don't know. Uh, I, I I never I never ask him me such question. Um, I I I think that I like to be uh, a teacher. Yes. A teacher. Yeah. 
Thank of you. all the people in the world. <laughs> uh, not just a teacher, you know, just a person that uh, who like take care of uh, other people. Oh, okay. I didn't realize us teachers took care of people. <laughs> um, okay, what would you like to teach? I think that I, I like to teach psychology. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I like to teach psychology because uh, um, I study psychology and uh, uh, I like have the opportunity in the future to uh, help people to know about this uh, this field, you know. And um, yeah, I think that uh, I like uh, to be a teacher of psychology. Okay, what um, what ages would you like to teach? Who would you like to teach? Oh, this is a good question because in the past I thought uh, about the possibility to teach uh, uh, to young people uh, like children, but uh, now. And then what happened? You taught them, and <laughs> no. you realized. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. But I don't know. Maybe there is some limitation about the argument. You know, you can talk about. Uh, I don't know. Some stuff, uh, but uh, when you get too old, uh, maybe you you like uh, have the opportunity to to talk with uh, uh, with people that have your same age, you know. So. <laughs> yes. Okay. All right. Good. Thank you, no, Salvo. Like uh, or I'm sorry, Andrea. Yeah. Can you ask? Um, let's say, can you ask Salva the same question? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, uh, so where is people in? Because it's the first time that I'm using the instrument. So basically, oh, no, no problem. Um, we have okay. She, her name uh, in the Google Hangout is so 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 so. so. Uh, but her name is Salva. Salva, Salva or Salva? Salva. Yes. Yeah, so can you ask her the same question? I asked you if you could be any famous person for a week. Who would you be? Okay. Um, Salvo, I'm going. Salvo, I'm going to mute you because it's a little noisy. But when you want to speak, speak up. This question is for Salva, who's next to you. Salva, okay. go okay. ahead, Andrea. So, hi, Salva. I'd like to ask you uh, if you have the opportunity. Is it correct to be uh, any any kind of person who you if like to you, be? If you could be, if you if, could be. If you could be. Um, anyone. Uh, anyone. Who who you like to be? Who would you be? Good. You Thank you. Excellent. Salwa, go ahead. I listen to you, but uh, my English is uh, not very well. <laughs> just listen. You just want to listen? Yeah, just listen. And uh, took just listen. <laughs> Because my English is uh, not very well. But then your English can get better when you practice. <laughs> That's, right. <laughs> That's okay. why you are here, yes? Salva. Yes. yes. Can I hear you? Salvo. I can yes. hear you. You, can, you cannot hear us. Ah, uh, and... I wanted to be a uh, actor, American actor. Okay, Salvo. Salvo is taking your spot. Okay, Salvo. Who? Which actor? Which American actor would you be? Uh, uh Brad Pitt. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Why? What uh, would you do? Why? Uh, I don't say all because he's a uh, beautiful, uh, handsome uh, man. <laughs> yeah. Also, but he, but you would want to have his life for one week. <laughs> uh, w one week? Uh, no. Also, two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You know he has like twenty children now, right? Ah yes, because uh, uh, he has uh, a lot of children. I can uh, I, I can help uh, other children. 
Sort That's of, why uh, you, yeah, I'm sure. You're choosing Brad Pitt because you want to help his children. <laughs> <laughs> help his children. Uh, help, uh, help uh, all. Uh, can, he can uh, uh, do a lot uh, uh, to go in uh, other country to go see uh, monument uh, art uh, can uh, do a uh, beautiful uh, beautiful movie. Um, I know it's too small. You can make beautiful um, movies. Uh, yeah. I don't know where this. Is. So so I'm going to mute you. Okay. Um. All right. Thank you, Salvo and Akram. <laughs> Indeed. Okay, welcome. Okay. Uh, yes, we can hear you. Um, Akram. Salvo, can you try to ask Akram the same question? Um, Akram. Salvo, can you uh, ask Akram the same question? If, uh, if I was, if, if you were a famous, uh, a famous uh, per person, uh, could you do uh, to be? No, is it okay. correct? <laughs> good. No, that was really that was really good. Yeah. Um, oh, Akram's gone now. All right. So whatever. Okay. New question. New question. Does anyone have a question they would like to ask? I have a list of questions here, but does anyone have some other question that they'd like to throw out there? Um. I want to answer okay, no. the last question. <laughs> okay, go ahead. And uh, I just want to know: uh, forever be uh, someone, or just for a few weeks or months? For a week. If you could have someone else's life for a week, whose would it be? Oh, uh, it would be Bill Gates. <laughs> <laughs> okay, why? <laughs> Because he's a billionaire, and I will do whatever I want, and you no, know, I will send a lot of money to my account. <laughs> After I, <laughs> and I will change. <laughs> I will okay. be bankruptcy. <laughs> okay, you would be Bill Gates, or you could send a lot of money to your personal account back as yeah. Arthur or when the week is over. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. To be a, someone, the actor, you can't change your life after one week, you will forget about it. But to be a Bill Gates and send money to you, wow. <laughs> 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 you guys always make me laugh. Okay. Um, good. Thank you. Arthur, okay. Did anyone else want to answer this question? Levi, did you want to answer this question? You know, when... Um, when he said Bill Gates, I thought the same thing, and I'm really <laughs> surprised that we came up with the same the same answer <laughs> of what we would do if we were Bill Gates. I guess it. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Okay. All right. That's funny. That's so interesting. Um. Okay. Cool. What about Nemo? Are you back? You are. Yeah, I'm back. Okay. So um. Uh, Arthur, can you ask Nemo the same question? Okay, Nemo, uh, who you who you would like to be for one week in the world? Who would you like Who's... to be for one week? Mm -hmm. one, uh, okay, uh, I would like to be the president of Egypt for one week. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what would you do? Uh, uh, I would uh, do a lot of things, you know. Um, I would. <laughs> <try> to... <laughs> well, what was that? Not, 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 not with the, with the Muslim Brotherhood. <laughs> Akram, I just heard you. <laughs> okay. I, I want to, uh, you know, there's a, a big project on the uh, Suez Canal. Swiss Channel. I want to uh, to try to to um, you know to, to get it in, in process uh, uh, faster. Make yeah. the process. Uh, did you say raising camels? The 
Suez Canal. Suez Canal. Oh, the Suez. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds horrible. Okay. Are you raising camel? God, this is horrible. Okay. Oh, all right. Okay. You'd want to speed up that process? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Okay. Good. What about. Oh, Akram keeps coming and going, and he's also from Egypt. That would be a good question for him, too. Um, all right. Okay. Cool. Thank you. I guess who else? All right. I think we have time for maybe one question for everyone. Does anyone have uh, any questions that they'd like to throw out there before I go to the last one? Okay. Um, hmm. Let's why, say, oh, if I you, have a question. Go ahead. Go ahead. Um, why does everybody want to learn English? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. <laughs> Who wants to start with that? Uh, in my case, it's obviously <laughs> uh, I'm in United States and I need to know English because to to get a good, uh, well-paid job, to have a new friends, American friends, and be free. Like, mm, you know, if you can't speak well, uh, you can't do whatever you want. Uh, if you in the, that country, I mean, who lives uh, in other country, he should know the that country's language. And in my case, it's obviously <laughs> I'm here to improve my. Yeah, it's kind of uh, maybe funny to live in United States and learn English on the verbling, but Is really, it? it's yeah, but it's really uh, hard because. Here, a uh, lot of Armenians and Mexicans, and it's seldom to find Americans here. <laughs> uh, even in the streets, when you want to cross the world, uh, there, there should be written, look out, but there is a written in Armenia, you know. In, mm. uh, I live in Glendale, and you know, one third of Glendale are Armenians. <laughs> Yeah, so, um, okay, that's a good point. Arthur, uh, do you find that it's difficult for you to communicate uh, where you are? Because I feel your English is pretty good. I think you, I don't think, I mean, do you run in, do you have problems communicating? Yeah, in a, like, yeah. Uh, you know, uh, I just apply for the job uh, on your postal office. And just, you know, for my bad English, I passed the interview, job interview. And uh, now I need to mm, take a, a driver test and after join the job. So I, I think, you know, some some little bit I feel uh, upset when I can understand what they're saying. Usually I can, but you know, some black people speaking, they are using very ex many expressions and they speak very short and you can understand them. You know, I can understand you, but I can I can't understand some black people who speak very, very, you know, different. Um. Yeah. There's just we. There's a lot of slang. There's a lot yeah. of slang, and it's with all types of. It's with everyone. Everyone speaks slang. Um. So. Yeah, but uh, usually, mm, <laughs> you are saying are not or is not. They are saying ain't. You know, and a lot of things like that. A yeah. lot of um, a lot of we have um, cultural lesson in America. We have a a group um, like redneck people that use ain't a lot because technically it's not a word, yeah. Or have they added it? Uh, yeah. There's just in general um. Verbling is so wonderful and interesting because just everyone is from everywhere and we're all here at the same time and so it's really cool. But yeah, ain't is just, um, yeah, it's like, it's like, Arthur, you know what, if you want, I was thinking of giving a class on California slang or just uh, popular American slang. I did it one time, American Idioms, but I'm thinking more, I don't know, colloquial speech, more slang. I think I'm going to give a class. Yeah, I would like to participate in that class. <laughs> okay, um, it'll be this time I think in the in the in the morning, or for me, it, this is my like mid morning time. So this time is a really good time. 
Okay, Arthur, since you brought it up, I'll make a class for it. It'll be American Slang, and Levi, you are also welcome to join, if you like. Um, yeah, I like yeah. Just, uh, I send you a message in, my, in your Facebook. Just uh, send me a link, please. Okay. Um, slang is really important for understanding the language, and it can differ uh, from place to place. Um, so, yeah, that's... Um, I don't know, that's a good point. And also, you live in Glendale, so you probably hear Armenian every single day. <laughs> that yeah, might be, make it more difficult to learn English. Yeah, it's also, yeah, it has also good size because, you know, you, you are around a lot of your nations and you feel just a little like you are at home. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, okay, good. Uh, I don't know what happened. Um, that's a good question, Levi. Thank you for bringing it up. Nemo, what about you? I want to Why are you so much. Okay. I, uh, I want to, to learn English for my, to help me in my job. And I wanted to, uh, to, uh, to be able to communicate with, uh, with different people. And I, I, like, I like the English language. I always wonder what English sounds like to people um, who don't understand English at all. I wonder what it sounds like to the Italians in the class, Andrea and Salvo. One time I asked my friend from Italy what Americans sound like speaking English, and they said they, it sounds like we're dogs and we're barking. Cause we're like, arr, arr. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I lived in London last year, and they... Um, they told me the same thing that a lot of Americans just um, they're very I don't know it's very blunt how we pronounce some of our words I guess and it just doesn't flow as much. That's what I was told. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's not very pretty. But, Andrea, know, is that true? Oh, go ahead, Nemo. But you know, I really like the English, the American accent. I I like it. Uh, bit it's better than the British. <laughs> I. <laughs> The British accent sounds very weird. <laughs> Sometimes it's a little difficult to understand if you've learned one first. Yeah. Um, Andrea, what about you? Uh, I, um, we, we are talking about uh, why it's so important to know English. Am I correct? Yeah. Uh -huh. And or is it true? Do Americans sound like dogs? <laughs> no. I, 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 my opinion is that... Uh, uh, British Asian accent is uh, yeah, it's pretty weird compared with the American one. Um, uh, for me, it's more easier understand uh, like American movie instead of uh, you know British uh, talk. Or uh, it's more simple for me. I don't know why. Maybe because it's a more mixed language problem. But I don't know. And um, yeah. Um, I, sp I spent uh, uh, four months in uh, um, U U.S. Uh, in uh, in Oregon uh, last summer. Cool. Uh, yeah, it was not so hard to learn understand uh, uh, the language compared with the with the British uh, English. You know, it's, it's pretty hard in my opinion. What were you doing in Oregon? Um, with my university, uh, I made a I made a kind of exchange program in Oregon University, and uh, it was cool. It was very difficult for me to understand for the first time, for the first week, understand people, especially uh, officers and all people that work there. You know. Uh, about permissions and all I need to stay there, but after the first week, uh, everything becomes more was simple to understand, to communicate with others. Um, the problem was after when I came back, because uh, I, I just forget everything that I learned there. You know, uh, I mean, language yeah. is something that you have to practice. Every day, or you just forget. Yeah. It's yeah. So terrible. <laughs> Maybe no, it's, it's my... good, and that's why you're on Verbling. That's really cool. Okay. Uh, yeah. Arthur mentioned. Thank you for sharing, Andrea, and yeah. thank you everyone for being here. Um, the, yeah, the class is over. I'm teaching another class. Eleven. 
in three hours, um, teaching another two classes. So for people on the west side, it's going to be pretty late. But I will hopefully see you guys again later this week. Arthur, I will make a class um, about maybe California slang, uh, since that's what I know best. And if yeah. anyone would like to join, everyone's welcome. Connect, please connect with me on Facebook. You can find the link underneath okay. the video. I have to go and let other people start their class. But thank you guys so much for being here. It was a real pleasure meeting some of you new people. And thanks, Levi. Thank thanks you, for joining. Too. Thank you, too. We added a cool new dynamic. Bye. To the class. Bye. Thanks for having me. Bye. 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 Bye.